With COVID slowly but surely coming to an end, more places are opening on a daily basis. And with that, college is also allowing students to come back to campus for classes. And I'm one of those students who is returning to college. And with returning to college, a lot of new problems are presented. The foremost of which is how notoriously small dorms are. Personally, I'm used to having quite a bit of space to keep my two 32 inch monitors, speaker system, and a laptop all on a desk that is at least 60 inches wide. And going to college, I knew that desk was going to be almost cut in half, so that would present a lot of new challenges for me to overcome in creating a functional desk setup that still works in the way I'm used to with the desk setup I have at home. Having been aware of this problem for a while, I came up with quite a few ideas on how I could solve it or even try to make the desk as enjoyable as it is at home. Foremost, I knew that I would be going back and forth between the college and my home quite a bit as they're relatively close to each other. So I wasn't too worried about having to get the entire desk set up in the new dorm. I honestly just needed one monitor, a laptop, a keyboard and a mouse and I knew I would be good as that would allow me to leave the other monitor along with some other peripherals at home so I could have a desk set up in both areas for when I travel back and forth. Moreover, I also knew that the 32 inch LG monitor I have would work really well as a monitor and a TV as my dorm is really small so I'll be close to the monitor and 32 inches is an average TV size in a lot of dorms that I've seen thus far and it works as a really really high quality TV at that. Moreover, something that's kind of nice is there's already a desk in the dorm so I could save a little bit of money on buying a new desk. And whenever I bought my laptop, I knew that this laptop would be great for the things I do as it's one place I can store almost all the data I have and travel to different places without having to worry about bringing separate hard drives or moving files over as the laptop has all of my information on it that I can use to create these videos, do homework or research a project, for example. And I also knew I still had a laptop stand that's in a lot of my older desk setup videos left over so I could use that for the one monitor setup as when I have the two monitor setup, I just close my my laptop and set it to the side as I don't need a third screen when I have two 32 inch monitors but when I only have one having a second screen that is only 16 inches a decent sized monitor is really nice as I can store different things that I don't need but are beneficial to access with ease. Now with all my promising ideas on how to solve this main issue of trying to fit all these things into a small space without spending a ton of money I encountered a lot of problems as you likely expect the foremost of which was the size of the desk. The desk is tiny compared to the desk I have at home, like I mentioned earlier. And I just recently upgraded my desktop to be actually wider right before I left. So I got even more spoiled by the size. And that desk presented a lot of challenges as instead of having a little indent along the exterior at the top of the desk where you can mount a monitor, a lot of the side of the desk is covered in wood. So there's no place to clamp the monitor, which was a huge problem because the LG monitors I have only mount with a clamp. I don't have a regular stand I could use and I can't drill a hole in the desk as it's the college's property not mine. Moreover, with me going to college, I have very little money to spend on different things. So I was on an extremely tight budget and this actually became a little bit more of a challenge than I initially expected it to be while trying to make the desk still look aesthetically pleasing in the small environment. Additionally, I also could not bring the speaker system that I recently invested in to the college as the walls in the dorm are really thin and I didn't want to disturb people that are in dorms next to me. And it's also really big and I don't have a ton of space to keep the speaker system. So I had to leave that behind which also presented an issue of not having a speaker system for my setup. And finally, I only have one keyboard and mouse as both of the mouse and keyboard I have are extremely expensive. And as I mentioned earlier, I'm on a tight budget, so I could not just invest in a new mouse and keyboard for each place. So this also presented another issue. After a lot of messing around and working out different issues, I did overcome pretty much everything I just mentioned. Foremost, to give it that more pleasing aesthetic, I just bought some really cheap LEDs on Amazon and mounted them around the desk as it does add a more attractive appearance to even the cheapest looking desk setups in my personal opinion. I also figured out a way to modify the monitor so as to mount it under the desk. It just doesn't mount that well and it kind of angles a little bit so it makes me a little bit nervous as these monitors are $700 a piece but I will get a little piece of wood to put under the monitor to make it more level when mounted so I did overcome that issue just not perfectly. The speaker system on the 16 inch MacBook Pro is notorious for being among the best speaker systems on the market. So that was a no brainer whenever I opened up the laptop and started playing music through it I realized just how good they are which meant there was no need to invest in a big speaker setup for the desktop. So leaving the one at home worked out perfectly fine. 
And finally, the issues that I did not necessarily overcome, I just kind of accepted was that I would have a very cramped desk space and I would have to bring the mouse and keyboard back and forth every time I traveled between college and home, which are a little bit of a nuisance, but they're no big deal as I can still work just fine at each place, even with these issues. So in conclusion, despite the desk setup not being the giant desk setup I have at home, it still is more than functional for all the video editing, studying, and surfing the web that I usually do on a regular basis. And with that, I'm happy. Let me know any thoughts you have on how I can improve either my home desk setup or the desk setup at my dorm, as I won't be able to have both monitors in the same space for a long time, as I'm gonna need one in each space to edit these videos back and forth. Thank you for watching and please do consider subscribing as only 2% of the people who watch my videos are subscribed. And as a small content creator like myself, any support really does help.